Hi everybody, I'm Danny Dancer. I'm the social studies educator here at Children's Museum Houston. And today's Brain Break is part of our Boot Up Wonder Week, which is sponsored by Houston Livestock Show and Rodeo. So today I am gonna show you all how you can make your own bolo tie. Oh, what is a bolo tie, you might ask? Oh, you are about to find out. It's actually a super fancy schmancy accessory that you can wear around your neck, and it actually has a really interesting history around it. So a lot of times people will wear a bolo tie to, um, to show off their Texas pride, their Western heritage, if you will. And it actually happens to be the state tie of Texas. Did you know Texas has a state tie? I didn't know that, but we do. It's the bolo tie, and here's how you make it. For this activity, you need a length of yarn or twine, a straw, and a few beads. You also need some cardstock and some markers you can use to draw on it, and then you need some scissors and tape. To start with, draw a circle on your piece of cardstock and use your scissors to cut it out. You can do a star, you can do a Texas state, any kind of symbol that you think would represent Texas for you. Next, take your straw and cut two lengths of straw, each about an inch and a half long. Place them side by side on the back of your cardstock and tape them in place. Next, take your yarn or twine, go up through one straw, and down through the other one. This is the part that you'll actually wear around your neck, and then these are the parts of your tie that are going to hang down in front of you. You can make it as long as you like. Next, take a few beads and thread them onto one end of your yarn or your twine. Then tie a knot in the end to hold your beads in place. If you don't have beads, you can actually use another length of straw on the end and knot that in place instead. And there we have it, a bolo tie. Fancy schmancy, no? I warned you. Now you can wear your bolo tie in different ways if you want. You can tighten it all the way up if you're wearing a collared shirt that's buttoned up. You can loosen it a little bit like I have. You can even wear it down low, almost like a pendant. But either way, you know you're gonna look awesome. It's the state tie of Texas, what can we say? Thank you very much everybody for joining us for today's Brain Break. I hope you have a great rest of your week. We'll see you all again soon, bye.